Hello everybody and welcome back to another GeoGuessr video where I only use phone numbers I see on billboards or signs to figure out where I am in the world. Let's see which country we get. We have spawned in. Welcome to Morrison's. What, what country is this? What city? I don't want to find out for myself. I want to call them and ask. I have to disable my brain here because I don't want to accidentally discover where I am. Although, I feel like I might already know. Oh, look at this. Excite. Activity Center. Okay, here we go. Calling Excite. Hey, please, how can I help? Hello, is this, is this Excite Activity Center? Yeah, it is. Oh, I was looking to play. I was wondering um, where you guys are located. So we are at 80 Fresh Street, just beside um, Lidl and Greenock. Okay, um, is that near yeah. a, a Tesco's at all? Um, a wee bit. Uh, I'm not really good at directions. <laughs> oh, that's fine. See if you Google where um, Quickfit is in Greenock. And this is in... Um, Birmingham? No, no, this is in Greenock in Scotland. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm just, vi I'm traveling and I'm, I'm looking to come play and I'm essentially just trying to find where you guys are on the map. All right, okay. Yeah, we're just at 3 East Fresh Street, um, just beside Quickfit in Greenock. And that's near Glasgow? Yeah, it's about 20 minutes from Glasgow. Oh, okay. Which, uh, which direction? I didn't tell you. <laughs> <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> I'm so bad at directions. <laughs> that's fine. I appreciate it. At least I know I'm in Scotland now. <laughs> <laughs> so are you in Scotland just now? Yeah, I'm in Scotland. I just arrived. So are you in Glasgow, yeah? Yeah, well I'm coming um I'm coming towards Glasgow right now and I'm just trying to find yeah, I'm just trying to like, you know, right, play so a little bit. It's kinda like Glasgow and then you'll go through into Paisley and then Greenock. Oh Paisley? Greenock's just before Paisley. Oh awesome, yeah, I, okay. I see it here. Okay, awesome. I'll I'll probably be able to stop by today. <laughs> <laughs> right, no bother. I thank you very much. I'll talk to you soon. See you later, bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> Why was that so wholesome? <laughs> okay, well, she said something like green something. I thought this was in England for some reason. I don't remember exactly how she pronounced it, but she did say Paisley, and that's good enough for me. <laughs> that lady is so nice. <laughs> kind of wish I could go here and play, but but it's probably not for people my age. Maybe Xyz and I can go here. Okay, Paisley it is. Here we go. Whoa. Green knock. I think it's what she was saying. Oh, wow. We're nowhere close. 22 kilometers. Oh, wait. I thought that was further than it actually was. Not a bad first round. Oh, my. Look at all these chickens. Sorry. Oh, there's no way we're in America. This has to be like Norway, like it always is when you see a red barn. The coast is right there. I didn't even notice that. Damn, I think we have to be in South Africa, but I didn't expect it to look like this. Oh, would you look at that? Exactly what I was hoping for. A barn with a number. Sanford's Concrete. Here we go. Calling. Actually, they might be closed if it's South Africa. Oh, there's a sign here by the cows. Can I buy a cow? For all your residential cleaning requirements. NZ. There's no way we're in New Zealand. Okay, I made a huge mistake. I thought we were in South Africa. We're in New Zealand. Damn, New Zealand? There's no way they're open. Calling San Francisco. Oh, that's a nice song. Hello? Good morning. Speaking. Hello, my name is Benjamin Button. I, uh... Recently got a cement truck from you guys, and I was wondering where you guys' headquarters was. Wait, what? I mean, did I say something wrong? Hi, welcome to Stanford. The bulk metal and fertilizer added in silo. Hello? Hello, is this Stanford's concrete? Yeah, no. Oh, it's not? Uh... They literally said that it was, though. I'm so confused. <laughs> so who am I calling then? I mean, yeah, no. Like, listen to this. Hi, welcome to Sanford. Sanford's the concrete. What do you mean it's like like Sanford's concrete? Yeah, no. And she just hung up on me. <laughs> what? I didn't even get a chance to say anything yet. Did I say something wrong? Like, maybe she's just not in a good mood today or something. I'm not sure what that's about. Anywho, I hope her day gets better from here. Oh my god, it's 4 a.m. in New Zealand right now. Forget how far ahead they are. Maybe that's why she was upset. I'm calling... B and B now. Hello. Hello. Is this B and B? Uh, yes. I was wondering when you guys open. Um, probably about eight. Okay. And uh, whereabouts are you guys located? We're between Howarta and Patea. Okay, and that's in like um, northern, uh, by Auckland. No, no, that's um, in South Taranaki. Oh, okay, so it's more close to like Queenstown. Whoa, it'd be probably somewhere in the middle of Auckland and Queenstown. You've heard of New Plymouth? I have New yeah, Plymouth. Yeah. Um. Well, we're we're probably an hour south of New Plymouth. Oh, okay, but somewhere near like um Westmere or Wanganui. Closer to Wanganui, between New Plymouth and Wanganui. Oh, okay, so like by uh, Normanby. Yes. You're getting closer. Okay. So uh, you're pretty much by Stratford then? Um, Stratford's going the opposite direction. 
be oh. going through the Rewaken Normandy now. Oh, I see it now, I see it now. now. Awesome. So it's okay if I stop by in the next, like, 20 minutes? 20 minutes. <laughs> Would that be okay? What's the time? Yeah. Um, okay, and are you going to be staying from then? Yes, yeah, so that's what I'll be looking to do. Okay. Um, okay. I'm still in bed. <laughs> <laughs> What time is it okay, right now? Okay, it's really early. Yeah, I'm just traveling, um, so I don't really have... I haven't checked the clock in a while. It's only 10 to 5 in the morning. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I just landed and I kind of been up all day, so I wasn't sure. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so where are you now? Well, right now I'm coming down from um, Inglewood. Okay, so like, yep. I am um, near Stratford right now. And you guys have a cornfield right next to you, right? Not anymore. It's all being harvested. <laughs> okay, so it's totally cool if I play there, like play in the corn. I, I will put, I will turn uh, turn the porch light on. Well, I'll be there shortly, and then I will um, say hi, and we can make a reservation there. And then I'm going back to bed. <laughs> <laughs> you shouldn't do that. <laughs> Actually, I, I can wait till um, a more appropriate time to come in, I guess maybe around 8 a.m. Yeah, then what are you going to do until then? I'll just roam around like I've been doing. It's okay. Come in, and I'll just, I'll show you what everything, and if you want to make yourself a drink and everything, you can do that. Well, that sounds great. I'll see you at, uh, at 8 a.m. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Have a great night. You're going to come at 8, are you? Yes. <laughs> you should get some rest. <laughs> um, you sure now? Yeah, I'm sure. Okay. Bye-bye. <laughs> okay, see you then. See ya. Oh, man. That was bad. How did I, how do we get out of that? I at least told her that I'm coming during business hours. So that way, like, you know, nothing's suspect. But if I have her staying up from 4 a.m., like, waiting for me, that's bad. I was too deep into that. Damn. <laughs> Fuck. I'll call her back after this. Uh, actually, I'll call her back at 8, so that way she can sleep. Because <laughs> she's going to be sleeping right now. <laughs> okay. But while we were on the phone, I found out exactly where we were. <laughs> At 4 a.m. Thank God she was awake. <laughs> Let me go ahead and put it put us over here somewhere. Let's see. Holy cow, that was a good score. We were only three points shy of a perfect score. <laughs> I just feel so bad that she woke up to pick up the phone. I'm so sorry, lady. God bless that woman. On to the next round. Okay, here we are in some trees. What on earth is going on with this tree? <laughs> is that real? Is it just like a, a curved tree? No way that's real. It is real. How does that happen? How did they get that arc? Tree's kind of thick. Okay, there's a sign here. I think I can read this. There's just no way I can talk to a French person. Bonjour. Bonjour. Comment ça va? Bonjour. Bonjour. That person was just breathing on the mic. What the hell? I'm calling them back. Bonjour. Hello? Hello? Hello, uh, c'est Jack. How's it going? Huh? Do you speak English? Do you, do you speak English? Oh, that's an interesting way to pick up a call. I'm saying bonjour, and they're just breathing, and they don't even speak English. Hold <laughs> on. English to French. Where are you located? Où vous situez-vous? Où vous situez-vous? What city are you in? Dans quelle ville es-tu? Dans quelle ville es-tu? Going back again. Why aren't they picking up? Bonjour. Alright, well that guy, I'm not sure what's going on with him. Damn. My god, my door's closed by itself. It scared me. Holy shit. There's nobody home, so... I don't know if you guys can hear that. My door just shut on its own. Now every hair on my arm is standing up. <laughs> Come on. Now we need to figure out where we are. I've learned French. Dans quelle ville es-tu? 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 Dans a business with their phone number. I'm gonna call it. Let me practice my lines first. Where are you located? Où vous situez-vous? Où vous situez-vous? Où vous situez-vous? Où vous situez-vous? Dans quelle ville es-tu? Dans quelle ville es-tu? Dans quelle ville es-tu? Allô? Bonjour. Bonjour. Uh, où vous situez-vous? Ah ben, je ne sais pas. Oui. Vous êtes où? Uh, dans quelle ville es-tu? What? There's no way I fucked up that bad. He did say something. I don't know what he said. 
Hallo. Hallo, uh, Adomodo Echo. Come on. Uh, do you speak English? No. Uh, that's fine. Uh, Don Kale will S do. Okay. Um, Paris? Um, All right. Here we are. We find a phone number. There's a billboard over here. Okay, we're in Poland. That helps to know the area code. Here's a gas station. I might have to call the gas station. Okay, there's a phone number. Let me let me try and call the gas station and see where they are. <laughs> They're not gonna like me. Hello. Witam. Dzień dobry. I uh, VM Mr. Cheese Nia Duyas. Jeszcze raz. Uh, Viak in Mr. Cheese Nia Duyas. Hello. Hello. Suham. Do you speak English? Uh, a little. Uh, what city are you located in? I'm trying to get gas. Uh, you need gas? Yes. Uh, for, for car? For car. Yeah, we have it. What city are you in? Ruda Śląska. How do you spell that? R-U-D-A. Okay. S with, uh, with dot in <laughs> under S. Okay. L. Yeah. A with... <laughs> dot. S K and S. Where are you near? Is there a city nearby? Uh, near, uh, uh, I think, uh, Zabrze or Katowice. A uh, Katowice? Again? Katowice? Kat yes, yes, yes. <laughs> okay. I think it's. I think it's a uh, five. Yes, Katowice. Oh, you said Ruda Slaska. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, oh. I think it's ten minutes from Katowice here. Oh, that's in... awesome. Could I come get some gas? Yeah, we have a gas. How much gas do you guys have? How much? How many? How much? How many gas? I think a free lot is for for lead. Okay, as long as you guys have gas, I can come by. Okay. I thank you so much for helping me. <laughs> thank you too. <laughs> bye. <laughs> bye bye. Okay, that worked surprisingly well. I think we're in the right area. If we actually get this right. Oh, Orlin right here. Oh my god, I think I found it. Orlin. Is this the right one though? How would I know? <laughs> Is this actually it? Let me guess. Holy shit, that was. We started over here, I guess, in the roundabout. I can't believe I found the actual gas station. <laughs> I need to go get some gas now from that lady. All right, <laughs> we get an American round. Oh, this is Canada. How fast can we get this one? Heritage Marine. I'm glad we could have one American one in here though. America, baby. Let's see where they're at. Hello? 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 Hey, how's it going? All right. Hey, sorry, I was looking to get my boat repaired. What do you need done to it, sir? Um, well, the tail fin has been a bit finicky, and I've been just looking to have the motor uh, checked as well. What is it? Uh, it's it's a uh, it's an Orlando. It's uh, a bit old. What kind of engines on it? It's got a V6. How old is it? Uh, I believe it was uh, like mid 70s. It was my dad's. Well, whose drive system is on it? I think it's um, one of his. I, I don't remember exactly. Okay, I, we we got to get some more information, sir, to see if we can service it. Okay, if, I, it, if, if you it, could just bring it, it in. The Chevy engine? No, I, I, we're right, right now we're busy winterizing, but I mean, even we'd have to make an appointment. Fair. Okay, well, I, I can give him uh, my dad a call and I'll, I'll see um, Yeah. exactly what, but uh, where are you guys located? Joliet, Illinois. Okay, I, well, I appreciate okay. that. I'll, I'll talk okay. to him on a club back. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye. So he even mentioned the state. <laughs> he said Joy Head something Illinois. I thought that was West Coast for sure. Why would there be a boat shop if it wasn't near water? So it has to be up here. I think it's only fair that we get another call in and then figure out from someone else. I'm gonna try and buy this piece of land. Good afternoon, call all banker. Hello, my name is Herman Trout McGregory Daniels and I'm looking at a property here on Pleasant Street, Illinois. Okay, what's the address? Um, it's on Pleasant Street. I don't know the exact number. I think it's 403 or, or 399. Give me one second. All right. Is everything okay? Sorry? So do you guys operate out of uh, Illinois? Yes. Oh, nice. Where are you guys based out of? Sherwood. Okay. And this is Pleasant Street and Juliet? Yes. Have you been to Juliet? Yes, I have. It's, um, I, yeah, it's, we're right next door to Julia. It's not that far from here. Okay. And what are your questions on this property? Well, I'm looking to, um, put my business there. I was wondering if that's possible for, uh, for non-residential. Kind of and I haven't been to Illinois before. Whereabouts is Juliet? Well, if you're looking at this address, it's off of 80. The highway's right there off of 80. So we are 45 minutes from Chicago. Is it south there. of, uh, Chicago? Correct. Okay. So yeah, we're close. I mean, 80, if you're in Indianapolis, we're close to Indianapolis. 
and Hammond, you could take 80 to Hammond. Oh, yeah, the 80? Yes, we're oh, right okay, off yeah. of 80. Well, that, that street right there is right off of 80. Yeah, I'm seeing it now. What kind of business are you trying to? Um, well, basically, it's, um, well, I'm the CEO and founder of Walkie Slash. Okay. And um, I'm just looking to open a walkie store uh, right up here. I mean, I'm sure the neighborhood would love, uh, love the business. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to bring more businesses to Juliet. I'm trying to revive the city. Thank you. Thanks. Bye bye. Okay. So we know where Juliet is. I'm trying to figure out exactly where it is because we know we have this bridge here. I think it's on this side. I mean, I'm not sure which way we're facing. Okay, one McDono. Let's try and find that street. Oh, here it is. McDono Bridge. Yeah, baby. But before we guess, we're going to jump to the start. Let's back it up all the way to Market Street. And here we are. We're more towards the curb. So let me make sure we get the perfect score. There's our answer. What? Okay, good. <laughs> Five meters. I was gonna be pissed if it wasn't a perfect score. Moving on. Oh, here we go, baby. Top Cappy. Looks like they have English words. Maybe they speak English here. Still not sure what country this is, though. How am I gonna call them without knowing what language they speak? I guess we'll find out. Hello? Hello. Hey, how's it going? Fine. Do you, have, do you guys have pizza? Yeah. Oh, awesome. I, I was hoping to stop by. Where are you guys located? Excuse me? Where are you located? Gabriela. Okay, and which country is that? Oh, I didn't get the question off. Um, what else is there around here? Okay, we're gonna call K Market. It's right down the street from the other place. Hello? I'm gonna get a call. What the fuck? They're calling me back. It's Kiosk. Hey, is this Kioski? You? Kioski? Kioski? Yes. We. Oui. Where are you located? Finland. Finland. Awesome. I'm there too. What What city are you? Helsinki? Helsinki? Mm. Yes? Yeah. Okay. Espoo? I'm in Linna. Are you in Hel Helsinki? Okay. <laughs> I mean, we got a lot of information there. She said yes to Helsinki. All right. Well, we know we're in Helsinki, Finland. <laughs> now we just need to know whereabouts. Morning. Misa Asad? Hello. Hello. Hey? Hey? Misa Asad? Hello. Helsinki? Ravintola Berkin, hello. Uh, where are you located? Berkin, Hamelina. Katajanaskaka? Do you want a grill? Order something or what? Yeah. I want to pick up. Yeah, okay. Well, which kind of pizza? I would like pepperoni pizza, but I want to know where you guys are located. Pepperoni pizza. What else do you want in it? Pepperoni, yes. And okay. ke kebab. Uh, do you want oregano garlic kebab also? Can I have um, kebab, else? pepperoni, and, and? and kebab, kebab? Pepperoni and kebab. Okay. Something else? Kebab, pepperoni. Okay. Something else? Yes. And then one last thing. Garlic? Garlic, kebab, pepperoni. Okay. You want oregano? No, but yes, and garlic. Okay. Ke kebab, pizza, kebab. Kebab and pepperoni pizza. Ten minutes, it's ready. So where are you located? We are in Hamelina. Is that close to Helsinki? No, 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 sorry. Not in Helsinki. How far away? About 100 kilometers. I'll be there soon. Do you soon. want a pepperoni kebab pizza? I want kebab pizza. How long pizza? you going to be there? How many, how many minutes you're going to be here? I will be there very soon. Okay, see you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. I wanted to make sure he didn't place the order. I know I didn't. I didn't want to have to mess with him like that. Oh, my Hey. Hey. Are, are you located in Helsinki? Uh, no, I'm working in uh, it's, uh, it's called uh, for Hamelina. Oh, Hamelina. Yes. Okay, and uh, where are you near? Uh, near. Like, what's nearby? Is there something next to you? I'm on my way to Hamelina right now, and I'm okay. trying to find your your restaurant. Okay. I see um Von Nail. Uh, pub Von Nail. What else do you see? I see Ravintola Top Cappy. Ah, okay. That's a little bit, well, not that far away. Uh, are you still coming to eat? Yeah. Because our kitchen closes in 15 minutes. Okay, I'll be really quick then. Uh, are you by yourself? Yeah, just one. Okay, yeah, I will tell the kitchen that uh, one more person is coming. That sounds amazing. I'll be there very soon. Yeah, okay, we'll see you soon. Thank you. Bye bye. Goodbye. Okay, we know we're heading to Havelina now. I, I see, I recognize um, Top Cappy. That's the guy we just called, so I'm gonna go right here. Oh, I forgot, oh, I forgot to backtrack. We lost three points, but that's a pretty good score. Not a bad score. This is my most accurate video yet. I've tried this twice before. The first time was in Just America. The second time I did random places across the world. A lot of places didn't make it into videos. I tried, you know, Japan and all that. They're obviously closed. And it's impossible to get Asia involved unless I'm up at like 3 a.m. But uh, I would actually like to do an Asian one. I just don't want to try and do the accents because I feel like that'd be very offensive. Anywho, yeah, hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Subscribe, and peace.